involving getting injured during a cheerleading competition. Joining us today are attorneys Ed Serimboli and the guy that does it all, attorney Greg <laughs> Fellerman. Ever do any cheerleading in your past, Greg? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How did we know that? Well, anyway, let's get to the question. This one involves uh, an injury with cheerleading and Dan in Frackville. My daughter was at a cheerleading competition and one of the old cast iron radiators fell on her, breaking her right leg. The, flag, uh, the, the facility is saying the cheerleading organization is responsible. Who is right in this case? Well, Dan, very simply, we've, we actually, believe it or not, had this exact case. Um, at the facility and the cheerleading organization may both be responsible. There's going to be a contract between the cheerleading organization that was hosting this particular competition and the facility where it was held. Very simply, the, uh, if the premises weren't safe, the facility is going to be on the hook for that. However, depending on the language of the contract, there may be uh, some liability that's also uh, going to attach to the organization as well. Yeah, and, and in these situations, it's, it's incumbent upon the organization to make sure they're dealing with a place that's safe and then the, the, the place that's hosting it, if it's a gym, some, whatever center it is, they got to make sure that radiators are hooked up and they're not falling off the wall because they have a duty to maintain and keep that safe to the people who come in. They're, they're business invitees, and that's, a, that's a, a, an, a, a legal term that gives you protection when you go into a, a building. So you're presumed to be safe, that you're not going to get hurt. And in this case, there was you know, big-time failures. All right, some good advice from attorneys Greg Fellerman and Ed Saramboli. For our viewers that may have questions about people getting injured, um, how can they reach you guys? They could call us at 570-714-HURT, or they could see us on the web at 714hurt.com. Or go to our Facebook page. And if you like us on our Facebook page, you can post a question. We'll do our best to answer it on an upcoming segment. And Greg will do his best in between all the other jobs that he has. <laughs> Absolutely. Award-winning attorneys. Results matter with Greg Fellerman and Ed and Bully. Gentlemen, thanks so much. Thank thanks you for having us. All right, you can get your question featured on the Law and You by heading to pahomepage.com or giving us a call on the hotline.